I am not Batman. Or am I? Well, I'm not Batman, but this Lego set is. DC fans rejoice as we are getting, I think, the first uh, Lego helmet cowl slash display piece for you DC fans out there. Set number 76182 with 410 pieces. Funny enough, it was first uh, shown as a pre-order for a Barnes & Noble US locations. The link was available for some time, but as of now, Barnes & Noble has pulled to the website. You can no longer pre-order the Batman cowl. The information uh, there is, however, that it's gonna come out on the 26th for 60 bucks. Uh, the same date that we're gonna be getting the probe droid, the Darth Vader and the Scout Trooper from Star Wars lineup. So there's gonna be a big day for all you collectors that are willing to fill their shelves with the displayable helmets or heads. One thing that is interesting about this set is that we finally know how LEGO will be handling faces in such display pieces. Because uh, we were debating like are we gonna be getting Star Wars helmets in the future like a uh, X-Wings pilot's helmet or something like that which has parts of the face shown. Now we know that in this approach LEGO is using transparent dark grey pieces or just transparent black pieces. Uh, in, th in the place where normally the face would be, so that doesn't spur any sort of like weird uh, looks because brick build face might not look as great honestly and I think it's a good approach So it's just a cowl on a semi-transparent display stand I do like that approach you can see uh, how well it's built when it comes to shaping of Batman's iconic eyes I do like this element here with the wedges uh, and going towards the nose which makes this Batman's iconic nose shape as well and the ears are also simply built with um, inverted uh, slopes in there so actually creates that kind of like a sleek look for that particular guy par particular cowl I do like it I think it's gonna be a great addition to the lineup especially that the Marvel fans got the Iron Man mask now you know if you think about the most iconic character from uh, DC Batman is like mostly the first choice for many so this is good I'm gonna be picking up this set even though I'm not a biggest DC fan but Batman is like such a big character that most likely a lot of people will still get it the box Black box, of course, you get the set number, this is the piece count, and uh, some of the, the comic book Batman looks uh, to just show how uh, close it is. I think it might be a very good set overall. Um, you know, from that Star Wars launch, I was seeing the Vader, and people said like, and I, I was thinking that Vader is not the best look overall, but Batman, uh, being another very iconic character to another universe, is captured pretty darn well. So I don't feel anything of oddity or weirdness about this mask I think the shape especially also that that look at the bottom here is captured pretty nicely so many people will be quite happy about that one also we had some lifestyle shots I'm here right now at the promo bricks DE links in the description below you can see also the size of it so it's not gonna be either smaller or bigger than anything else it's gonna be a good look on your display shelf uh, I think that these guys like the, the actual uh, busts helmets heads you name it are kind of becoming the new brickheads of sorts. I think there's gonna be a, a growing collection in the future uh, because there is plentiful of characters that can be depicted that way and they can basically go along the way of the entirety of brickheads dim and make them a helmet if they wish so, as long as they keep uh, the good approach to faces. We don't really want to bring, see those brick build faces because they're gonna actually look weird. And I believe that Batman will be getting sort of a good treatment this year. Uh, Promo Bricks DE is posting the uh, list of possible sets uh, confirmed uh, some rumors and whatnot uh, when it comes to 2021. We have some vehicles, those are like smaller 15, 30, 40. Uh, the call is 60, as I mentioned. Uh, did I say 70? Maybe, maybe. It's, it's 60 bucks. Uh, and there's also gonna be a big, large DC Batman 18 Plus set for 230 coming somewhere in November. So that's gonna be something along the lines of the Batmobile or the Batwing. We can expect that to happen for sure. Right on! I mean, that's awesome! Uh, yeah. Batman? Everybody wants Batman, so right now we have to pick up the pickups for uh, Star Wars. Uh, droid, which is great, the Vader and the Scout Trooper, all coming on the 26th of April. Batman is joining the ranks, we have Carnage, we have Venom from Marvel. Oh boy, that's gonna be a growing collection. I, I'm gonna probably try to at some point get all of these and just have them on the shelf because I do have the Boba Fett, I do have, I'm looking at them right now, Stormtrooper. Trooper, I do have the TIE Pilot. These look great and if they keep the quality uh, w when it comes to those, those builds in the future, that's gonna be even a bigger thing than Brickheads ever were, uh, in my opinion. So stay tuned for more, I guess. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed this quick little recap of the Batman unveiling. Uh, the cowl was lifted <laughs> for that set and I hope to see you in more videos. Click the like, subscribe, do all those things that I usually ask you to do because it actually does help me grow the channel. So hit the like button, like button 
for the algorithm. Thank you guys so much for watching. It was Mike. See you next time on The Cool Factor. Peace out. Bye.